do. Wake that ass up. <laughs> rise and grind. Rise and grind, baby. The live hip hop daily rise and grind morning show. Woo! We got the number one morning show to hit Atlanta, man. Rise and grind morning show. Get your ass up and tune in. www.livehiphopdaily.tv. Get that app, baby. Yeah. So you know we just gonna hop straight into the shit. Live hip hop Dallas DJ Larry Love. It's a Thursday. We're gonna go inside the industry, really in the industry. You know, I got the OG on the end, Detroit representative Big Vaughn. And we what got up, what up, what AB up, what Baby up, what up, with us, man. You know. Hey, yo, what's up, man? So, Boy, you know, AB, uh, baby. AB Baby, man, you know, you, I feel like you got the young, man, you got all my young hoes. You know, I feel like when I, I feel like you got every girl that I can't get, you know what I'm saying? And then we got the OG with us, man. But what's up, man? You know, we had you here with, you know, so rest in peace to my brother, Sneaker Q. Um, That's crazy, man. Hold your, hold your mic up. It's emotional right now, and it's like um, bringing back memories. You yeah, know we was saying? talking so about that, man, and it's it's kind of like man, to it's almost bittersweet because I think that's when you first came down here. Yeah, man. you know, what I'm saying that's when I first that's met crazy. you. That's crazy. And um, it was just uh, it was sentimental. I think it was a Wednesday. Mm. Of course, it was a Wednesday. We used to do our Wednesday shows at seven o'clock, and that was my first time meeting Big Vaughn. But definitely, man, um, it's good to see y'all in the new year, man. I'm pretty sure Q is looking down on this interview, like y'all still, you know, we. I tell people every day, I, I keep it going for my dog. You know, what I'm saying every day, I could have been doing a whole lot of different other things, man. But I definitely keep this shit going for my dog, man. And 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 it's a new year, man, and it's new and it's new endeavors, man. You yeah. know what I'm saying? It's definitely Big Vaughn. I know we were just talking off camera about, um, so far as what y'all got coming up. You know, yeah. shout out to, uh, we just, just, uh, just was, was that Monday? We had your, your dog Black Goose came through. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? We was talking, yeah. we was talking to uh, Black Goose about just uh, just keeping it focused, man. It's coming from that, you mm -hmm. from Detroit, you from Cali, man. Just, you know, sticking with your passion about things, yeah. man. And uh, like you, you know, you, man, you know, you didn't, you got credits from Ice Cube, the Fetty Wap. Yeah, you know, yeah, we, the yeah. list goes mm -hmm. on, man. And working with these new young artists is what keeps you kind of like in tune with, you know what, I, I see something. This is can, this can be a, this can, this is the next, this is the next wave. Like what keeps you, how do you know what's the next wave basically? I mean, I really stick away from people who, uh, follow trends you know what i'm okay. saying i've been the kind of guy man you got to make your own trend up you know okay. what i'm saying you can't just follow people I always be a leader not a follower so when i see artists that got their own brand and trend going that's what really pulled me to them and want to work but okay. if you're trying to be like the next artist that's out there already that ain't making no sense to me like even though that's the new wave right now everybody doing the same thing doing the same right but it ain't really that's not what i look for and i've been doing this 19 years right and been blessed to achieve a lot of accomplishments in this business but um, as far as searching for producers, songwriters, artists, you know, you just got to be different. Right. You know what I'm saying? My dog, Black Goose, different. He got a different voice. Y'all going to hear his music. So I try to put my hands or connect people that I know that's meant to be connected. Right, I'm right. An energy person. Right. You know what I'm saying? That's how I work off energy. Right. And with, let me ask you the same thing, A.B. What keeps you every day to trust this man with your, because with your, he's going to be responsible for your upbringing in the industry. You know what I'm saying? So yeah. what? what what makes you wake up every day and be like, you know what, I, I'm rocking with Vaughn. Like, what keeps you going every day? What's your motivation? Well, first off, Vaughn, man, I never met someone that just, you know, pushes you as right. much as he does. Cause, right. You know, nobody really out here has people that like this, you know, yeah. that believe in you and stuff like that. So just, say, just seeing how consistent he is and everything like that, right. especially with other people on the team and stuff right. like that. Like, was you ever I appreciate it. I appreciate him. For was real. you ever in a group, or was you always? No, I'm, I was always independent. Always independent. Yeah. Okay. I was always so that transition to just then you got to produce in your corner, man. It's also when you got to produce your slash manager, mentor. It's, yeah. it's better than paying for that shit every yeah. time because yeah. Yeah. sometimes when you pay for it, people just do the shit for the money because you know so they know you can pay for it. And it's, it's when you get past that scenario, it's always a better you know relationship and friendship. Yo. So do you got big plans? I know you got some big plans for this year, man. Yeah. This How you year. liking Atlanta, man? Uh, Atlanta's cool, okay. man. You live down here, you just be back and forth. No, nah, I, I, nah, I don't even. That snow here, he, he yeah. come from Cali, so okay. you know it's sunny out so you just, San Diego. So, so you just jumped down. Was you here for the snowstorm a few days ago? Nah. Okay, okay, boy, you just missed it then, because yeah, you, just, you yeah. just missed it, because Atlanta, these people don't, hey, bro, the people don't know how to drive. Ubers don't know how to oh, drive. Oh, we seen it. We seen it all. Bro, right. we, we, were so, yeah. <laughs> we were driving up the street and everything we see cars on the side of the road <laughs> and you know and you, people's houses and stuff <laughs> that's crazy so coming from that cali weather man like that's a from san diego to atlanta you know what i'm saying how, how, how is it like how is it what's so what's the number one different thing so far as the women that you notice here that you meet uh are they more aggressive here or what what would you say in cali were they are they more aggressive like are, are they 
more what's the word like what's 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 the difference between here women here and women back home yeah, like you said, aggressiveness. That, that's the most, like, so far as, do, do yeah, a lot of grown differences. women, like, you get, have you got the grown women, like, 30 and up yet coming at you? <laughs> yeah. I, I believe it. This, <laughs> that's what I'm saying. Don't be nervous. Yeah, I mean, this yeah. Atlanta, like, it's kind of like, not it's the cougar, you got to be aware of the cougars. Some cougars can help you, but mm-hmm. half of them bitches, that's they just. my favorite, though. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, I mean. I love cougars. Wh- why, I mean, you right. You don't, you don't like girls your age? I mean, yeah. You know what I'm saying? I do, but. All the women, uh, <laughs> this guy, oh, man, you hang with Big Vaughn too much, man. That's what it is. You with Big Vaughn way too much, <laughs> but, uh, <laughs> out, man. you know what I'm saying. But y'all, uh, definitely, y'all, um, y'all got something coming up for uh, I know y'all had how was y'all part? Y'all got a was it at you got a party coming yeah, up? Yeah, we got a party. Shout out to Chosen, my dog Chosen, to his uh, mixtape release party tonight at okay. uh, Escobar, you okay. know what I'm saying? So, okay. uh, we're gonna be doing that, you know, put it up in the air, come turn up with us, go crazy, man, right? Yeah, right, so, right. Uh, Chosen worked on a project, got some, you know, some people on there, good project, you know, I'm gonna okay. let y'all hear it too, but it's tonight. You know okay. what I'm saying? So everybody follow Chosen Lyrics. That's my other dog, too. Okay. Other artists I'm working with. So you, what you got in plan, Big Vaughn, for the new year, movies. man? Movies. Movies. I told visual, you the last time. Is, movies, is visuals, the, is yeah. that the next step, man? Is yeah, that movie, really what? It's still music and everything, but I just, you know, the route I'm taking is more visual with the movies and uh, TV shows, skits. I'm going to do a lot of comedy skits now. I got me a comedy page. Okay. You know, by me having a relationship with a lot of different comedians. You know what I'm saying? That's one of the things you want to have in this industry is a relationship with somebody that's viral. Okay. Because all it takes is for you to work with them and yeah. if you're friends with them, you know what I'm saying? That start off career. And that's how people pop off today. You can be a nobody one month and then two months later, you somebody. Yeah, yeah. You know what yeah, I'm saying? Yeah. So it's like, it's it's really the internet is doing that to a lot of artists and comedians and everything. You just got to stay in front of that net. And that's crazy. I see you got a dope following, man. How many figure like eighty thousand, sixty thousand? You got a nice following, man. Yeah, yeah, I got a good amount of yeah, man. So with that being said, do you get more people in your DMs that's trying to do business, or are you just more so just for fun in your DMs right now? More for fun. More for fun. Yeah. But what about the business? Do do you get? But I, mean, I still, yeah, I still get some. So people try to book you yeah. through your DMs. Yeah. yeah. Okay. So um. Which I can see you doing a lot of proms and homecomings and stuff this year. Like, what's your what's your what's your what's your plans for the year, the new year? For the new year, uh, I'm really just trying to progress and expand. Like, not only am I gonna do music and stuff like that, but I'm yeah. also looking into acting and okay, okay. modeling and stuff like that. So yeah, okay. so I'm you just trying to do a little bit of everything, that. you know? I can see you being in front of the camera so, doing yeah. that. You uh, I I guess do you, would you would you, what's the word? What's the what 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 kind of act what like what would you see yourself in a movie like what type of act do you, do you see yourself more so on the showing your side of the acting so far as the the, the music game or just playing an all out different whatever role? whatever okay, okay. Whatever okay. character, you know. Whatever character, Big Vaughn. Pretty yeah, sure you got yeah. some uh some thoughts in mind for that. Yeah, yeah. I'm just you know trying to uh touch everything you can. You know? Yeah. Everybody yeah. tells me you got the look, you got the voice. So yeah, I'm trying yeah. Trying to put him in position to win. Okay. You know, just you know for his uh. For you know, just for San Diego, for yeah. one, because I don't, I don't see that many artists. You what's the What's the last out biggest artist out of San Diego? That's what I'm saying I don't even know, and no disrespect to San Diego. What about Diego. the group? Ain't no group ever came out of San Diego. Yeah, I think uh, old boy that's on um, Jermaine Dupree's show, uh, the kid show he got. Uh, okay, growing little up, Nico, huh? Little who? Little Nico. Yeah, little Nico. Nico. Shout he's out from, little Nico. Oh, he's from Shout San Diego? out to his moms too. Yeah, he uh, he the yeah. only one out of San Diego. So is it more right sports? Now. Is it more sports coming up? Was it? What's what? Yeah. Is it? Sports yeah, coming sports. up? Yeah, okay. Sports. Okay. Yeah. Sports out of there. But as far as entertainment, hip hop, you know, or overall, I don't okay. really see that many artists popping yeah. out. So I just want to make him a brand from coming, you know, from California. So you gonna have a whole city behind you, yeah. when, you when you really pop. Yeah, man. He started his own fan. Shout out to everybody, everybody in San Diego too. You so, start. He started his own fan base. Yeah, yeah. Like I said, YouTube. Facebook, them your friends, man. Yeah, you know what I'm saying? yeah. When you're not in the studio, you can always turn to any of that social media. You know yeah, what I'm saying? Yeah. And, you know, uh, present yourself on there. So, yeah. So definitely, man. Um, so, how you doing the project this year so far as the album? Yeah, take? I'm working on an album right now. Okay. It should be finished by next month for sure. By next month, you gonna have a yeah. mixtape release party here in Atlanta? Yeah, probably. Okay, we gotta. You know, definitely yeah. gotta do it big like that, man. I, um. What's, so you got any? Can we expect anybody? Can you name? Can we jump name jump anything that we can expect from that yet? We got it. Not yet. Uh yeah. Shout out to um. I got some records with uh with my boy Eno. Shout out to Eno. Okay. I am Eno Star. He, okay. He goes crazy, man. Okay. And uh yeah, Black Goose. Okay. Um, Chosen too. Okay. What's uh, the name of this title? 
I mean, honestly, no I'm not even sure. Yeah, okay. I still gotta oh, come up with that. No, yeah, we just yeah. been cutting records. You so know? That, is that how it goes in the studio? Yeah, you yeah, just don't nobody. Yeah. They yeah. don't do the titles of their albums or they make stuff. You know, seven. Uh, yeah. None of that stuff until like you done. You done. You know what I'm saying? Okay. Because it really take all the focus on what you are gonna call the album or the project. So you gotta you focus more so on the production and the songs. You okay. Know what I'm before you get to the title. So do y'all go to the studio like every day? I just plan like. Two or three days a week, man. Because yeah. you don't have to be there every day. No, nah, you don't. When yeah. you get ideas, I like to go when I get ideas. I'm okay. a writer too, so like when okay. I get some in my head, I'll put it in my notes on my iPhone, and then okay. we go cut it. But you know, you okay. want to be getting the habit to you know to work as much as you can. Because okay. You want to you want to be great, and if okay. you, if that's what you're trying to be, you got to get your ass in there and do it. Okay. You know? Okay. So, okay. What was that Fetty Wild beep you did again? Because I told you couple bands. Couple bands. Remember the couple bands? We used to play that shit. Yeah, we just hey, hey, I remember 2014, 15 when that couple bands. Well, like, couple bands came out in the end of 15, in the 15, and, uh, 16, and, 15, uh, so 15, shout 16. out to uh, Saj, man, Saj and Fetty. We all had a little vibe we went with Fetty, and um, he ran with it. Okay, I just okay. seen him perform it the other day. You know, yeah, that, that song. That, I just and I, just, I think yeah. maybe the same thing. I just seen somebody had it on a Snapchat or something. Like, oh, they still rock one. Everybody said that should have been one of the singles. That should have been one of the singles. You know, shout out to Fetty Wap, man. Yeah, you know, that RGF. Yeah, that song is dope. And, uh, 300, man. Shout out to Big Sides, you know what I'm saying? That song um, is my, dope. my old team, man. Eno Star Chosen. Okay. You know what I'm saying? Sean Ski Beats, Arazi. Of okay. course, Abby Baby, Black Goose. Man, I, I like to show love to my whole team, man. So if anybody I'm leaving out, you know, so hey, you know who he is. Shout out to you. But And uh, also, man, you know, we got to. Spare our condolences for you know for the past two weeks. Rest in peace to the Fredo Santana man. Um, how do you? F- I mean, man, we was just talking about that. Like, we gotta really be <laughs> our mindset. Gotta change, man. Yeah. Because I know that's what's going on right now in the industry. But everybody don't have yeah discipline. It ain't really good, you know, for your for your mental. Yeah. You know what I'm yeah. saying? You gotta be able to think. Some people just live off of it. They gotta wake up and have it because they're addicted to it. Right. It's right. in their body now. So it's it's like waking up to eat breakfast. If you on that hunger, you know that hunger you yeah, get your stomach. Yeah. Up. That's what niggas feel when they. Is that drug is really that, bro, is lead, that, that drink is really that powerful? Is that serious? It's a hunger because I, as much as I've been down here and when I'm in sessions, people pull out them pints. You know what I'm saying? Easy. Right in the club. The co- yeah, anywhere like they had that shit with them. Like you know, I'm like, damn. damn. So this shit is really an addiction, and people don't know that it's that powerful. It it'll, it'll mess you up. So you I know, never, that's something I really never got into. I never, I like I took. I've never popped a pill. <laughs> none of that shit never did a line never did none of that type of scenario and i i don't know i mean i guess i found other ways to get my high i don't know I don't you don't know really. how it's going your body gonna react either like yeah. you know you may you may be having a good buzz or a good high yeah. but that shit may hit you later on yeah man you be ready to jump out the window and it's uh he was 27 man yeah damn yeah. he was 20 young you know, little peep how old was little peep he was even younger peep was only like 22 same type yeah. of drink man Zans and you know the rest of peace to pimp c yeah. You know what I'm saying? God damn. You know, like, Pimp C I, I, I really we didn't salute. learn from Pimp C? Yeah. <laughs> we ain't learn from Pimp C? They ain't like, even seriously. This, this day and age, the, the rap DJ ain't Screw. Even we ain't learn from yeah. DJ Screw? Shot to Houston where the drink really yeah, started. That's true. Didn't the drink really start in Texas? Yep. Yep. You know? But you know, rappers today that's really, you know, putting it in the air like Mozzie, man. Shout out to Mozzie, man. That nigga really telling people not to even fuck with it. And, you know, yeah. and, and that's one thing you want to put out. If you got a platform, use your platform yeah. for the best you can. You know what I'm saying? Because a lot of people don't do that. Just because you got 100 to 500 to a couple million followers, you got that platform for a reason. So use it to motivate, to educate yeah. people, man. You know what I'm saying? On a higher level. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. That's, that's why you there. I just can't Everybody see. Everybody blessed. You just it sounds so you. sad, man. Just dying from something. Just you fucking drinking out your fucking throat. Yeah. You know what I mean? Like that shit just sounds so simple to the point that it only sounds realistic, man. You know what it's, I mean? It's an ap- it's an appetite. I told yeah. you, people crave it. You know what I'm saying? And I'm glad I'm not into it because it really destroy lives. Like yeah, yeah, yeah. You know, people yeah. stop fucking with you because you really off the lean every day. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You know, so. But definitely, man. You know, definitely, man. We definitely encourage. You know, we got to touch all, and it was just, it was just so shocking to see that shit over last weekend. Man, man. it's like, all God, over damn. the net. As soon as you pick up anything on any social media, yeah. his pictures, and then he been around a lot of the big Drake. Just put up a picture of him, Diddy. Just put up a picture. You know, yeah. Like, yeah. Dude knew a lot of people. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? That's respect for somebody in the game that's been in to throw your picture up yeah. when they hear something about that. And they don't even really, you know, see you every day. You yeah. know what I'm saying? Yeah. So you had to yeah. been a genuine dude. Yeah, you know? definitely. 
Well, man, definitely, man. Until next time, you know. Next time we come here, AB, I may not be. I may be on some motherfucking billboard or something. You know what I'm saying? Hopefully, right, I don't, yeah. y'all forget about the little people. Hey, you know man, definitely. we we'll never forget about uh, nobody. You God is good. Keep God first, and man, we gonna keep rolling, putting out these projects. Yeah, new man. Movies, through TV shows, and more records. My brother Sneaker Q brought us together, so we gonna make sure. Yes, keep, man, man. Keep much working, love. Man. Rest in peace, Q. Man. But definitely, man. Dope yeah. episode. Make sure we gonna. He stay tuned with AB Baby has a store. You yeah, know what I'm saying? Man. Make sure drop your drop your uh drop your uh social yeah, handles. You could uh, follow me on Instagram at it's AB Baby as well as Facebook, YouTube, AB Baby. You know what I'm saying? My new single, Hello Ho, is up on every single platform. So just go check that out. Hello Ho. How the, how, you know how, how the reaction been to hello to the single, man? Yeah, he been doing numbers on on okay. more on Spotify. More like, Spotify. Yeah, they've been downloading and, and buying it a lot on so which surprised me because I thought it was gonna be on iTunes, but Spotify is slapping right now for some reason. Damn. You're getting a buzz the on The video's it. up too. Go check that out on my YouTube yeah. channel. Video video on Shot YouTube. Shout out to Derwin. Shout out to Shout Derwin. Out to Derwin who's my videographer. You know, so. Okay. So, yeah. Baby, baby working, man. Until next time, and we'll see y'all later. Live Hip Hop Daily, the Rise and Ground Morning Show. Big Vaughn, AB Baby, and here's DJ Follow Latin me on Love. Big Vaughn. I am Big Vaughn on Instagram. We out. We got hits productions, man. Until next time, man. We'll see y'all later, man.